morning. Welcome to 4 by 8 Paper Stuff. This is Beth. No beaver cam this morning. It's raining and the photographer is a delicate flower and she might melt. Me, me, me. So we're going right into the beaver art. Well, I know it's no fun doing these, um, what do you call them? Fast forward things, sped up videos, but I am on a crunch time. My dad came home from the hospital last night. Yes. Uh, uh, and so we are, he is home, but I haven't made the video for today yet. It's making it right now, right now. So I see a lot of things on Instagram where artists, uh, don't worry, I'm not calling myself an artist, put their artwork in a circle frame. So I went by that plate of paint in the left hand corner and drew that on my two sheets of painted paper. Um, and I'm going to make my circle, my art in a circle. And it's titled, uh, hmm, I'll save that to the end because the title's the best part if you ask me. Uh, and it's the beaver after he's through with my yard, all these tree stumps. That's all that's left. One year that happened, actually. Uh, he got a Japanese maple. He got red tips. He got a 25-year-old loquat. He got uh, lots and lots of branches from hydrangeas, uh, rhododendrons. He just demolished our yard. Uh, that was about two summers ago. Yeah, two summers ago. Now, mind you, some like the Japanese maple had wire around it. Now, my husband is living dangerously. He just planted two new rose bushes, and he's got wire around those, too. But... So my, this is my backyard and you see where, well, you may not be able to see them yet, but those have to dry. Uh, there were stumps sawed off. Now I did get inspiration off of, um, Instagram on a similar picture. Uh, and, and, oh, and this is the biggest thing I've done for myself lately. This stencil was 99 cents at Walmart and it's a wild animal stencil and I'm using the rabbit stencil out of that section. But I'm only using parts of it. I think James Burke told me how to do that. Use parts of things. So I used parts of the body of a rabbit. And, oops, my rabbit, my, my beaver's looking green. I have to keep adding more brown paint there. But um, I make a beaver that I love. And it's easy and uh, love it, love it, love it. So stencils. Use parts of what you need for what the animal you want. That was a rabbit, believe it or not. So I'm drying everything, and he's going to be my resident buddy that lives down by the water. Now, I don't know if he was out this morning because it's raining, and I didn't feel like going out there or putting extra clothes on to hide from the rain. And I have to go down on the lower deck now because the kitchen window blind is covered by the tree. It has all its leaves now, so you can't really see anything. So there's my title. I don't think you can see it yet. But it says, another one bites the dust. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just couldn't help it. I had to do it. Um, so, I like how this turned out. I think we only have one more day left. Um, we're putting all the elements together now. Uh, they're in a circle, theoretically. And it's a short video. I think tomorrow... Tuesday's video will be longer because um, I think that's the last page in our insert. See, doesn't that look like a beaver? It was a rabbit. It looks better than the ones I drew or pretty darn close to it, actually. Anyhow, so fun, fun, fun. Beavers biting the dust. When I saw... um this picture on Instagram that I was, it just was like a wild animal scene and it had beavers in it and it had the tree stumps. And I'm like, Oh, another one bites the dust. <laughs> like, Oh, that might be my video, but I didn't have the wherewithal to make it yesterday. So I'm making it this morning to post this morning. That's why it's short too. But my dad's home. That's the good news. Um, and there's my beaver. I think I, yeah, I start adding things to it to make it look more like this, the um, circle. 
those things on the sides are trees, just sections of trees that show up in the circle edge edges, and then the lake, and then the tree stumps. Look on Instagram for a closer picture. 4x8 stuff. 4x8 stuff. So, I do like that. And there's my title. So, thanks for watching. If you can, subscribe. Um, I'll see you all tomorrow for our last day in our beaver journal, which really has been kind of haphazard because of my schedule. Maybe I'll do a final flip through to tie it all together. I don't know. That might be a good idea, actually. Okay. See you all tomorrow.